Welcome back to another week of Tiger TV. I'm Andrew Rhodes. And I'm Megan Spencer. And to start off this week's episode, we'll be talking about the upcoming weeks here at PHS. On Wednesday, April 6th, there will be a blood drive at Princeton High School in the activity room. The address is 1008E Coleman Street. It is sponsored by the Dual Credit Speech Class and National Honor Society. Make sure to come down to the school and support your community. Prom tickets will be on sale from Monday, March 21st to Thursday, April 28th. Everyone attending prom needs to buy a ticket. This includes out-of-town dates and underclassmen. Tickets cost $20 per person. To purchase tickets, see Mrs. Hall. On April 1st at 6 p.m., there will be a teacher versus senior basketball game. Make sure to come on down to the gym for a fun-filled night of basketball. I can't wait to watch that game. Make sure you guys stay in the loop with everything going on. Now to Aubrey Willett with this week's weather report. Thanks guys. This week there will be highs ranging from the mid-40s to the 60s and lows will be in the high 20s to the mid-40s. There are chances of rain Wednesday and Saturday. That's all for now. Back to you guys in the studio. Thank you, Aubrey. Now listen to Maggie Hickman for another segment of Tiger Poles. Hi, I'm Maggie Hickman and welcome back to Tiger Poles. When do you do your homework? Uh, normally the night before or in my other school classes. What's your favorite subject in school? Uh, facts with Dr. Tina Louise Holt. What is your favorite class to teach? Physical science. Here are the results. The first question is, what's your favorite subject at school? 16% said art and math, 14% said PE, and 12% said history. The next question is, when did you do your homework? 44% said during the other classes, 36 said the night before, and 14% said right before class. The last question that we asked them was which type of assignment would you prefer? 32% said practice math problems, 28% said writing an essay, and 24% said reading a textbook. Thanks for watching. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Maggie. We definitely learned a lot about our PHS students. And now we'll send a Lauren Crone with this week's sports and organizations. Thanks, guys. This week, the baseball boys take on Hamilton at home on Monday. On Tuesday, varsity track heads to Lathrop and junior high track heads to Worth County. On Thursday, varsity track and baseball both compete at Trenton. And on Friday is the faculty versus senior staff game. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Lauren. And now to Andrew with this week's current event, March Madness. The Elite Eight of the NCAA March Madness Men's Basketball Tournament concluded this past weekend. Duke, North Carolina, Villanova, and Kansas all advanced to the Final Four. Duke won 78-69 to over Arkansas. North Carolina bested this year's Cinderella story, St. Peter's, by a score of 69-49. to Villanova advanced after a 50-44 to victory over Houston, and Kansas defeated Miami 76-50. to Kansas and Villanova face off Saturday, April 2nd at 5 p.m., and Duke and North Carolina will play at 7.30. The winners will advance to the national championship that will be played on April 4th. In other exciting news from this past weekend, the Northwest Missouri State Bearcats won their third straight national championship in men's basketball. Congrats to the team and go Bearcats! Thanks, Andrew. Sounds like a really exciting tournament. Now we're going to send it to Caden Ingram for this week's Student Spotlight. How long have you been attending school at Princeton? Um, I've gone to Princeton from preschool to my senior year. I have been attending school at Princeton since I was in preschool. I've been attending school at Princeton since my seventh grade year, so about five and a half years. I have been attending school at Princeton since kindergarten, so for 12 years. And what's your favorite memory so far? Um, like everybody knows, I tore my ACL my senior year, so getting to throw the first pitch on softball senior night was my favorite memory. Um, I'm just excited to graduate. <laughs> favorite memory from senior year is when we were stunting and Michaela fell on top of Cheyenne and her gum fell in Cheyenne's mouth. Pretty hilarious. <laughs> my favorite memory from my senior year was hitting a grand slam in our sectional game in softball. And what do you plan on doing after graduation? Um, I'm going to go to NCMC to achieve my Associate of Arts transfer degree while playing softball. And then hopefully I'll transfer to Mizzou to pursue physical therapy. So after graduation, what are your plans? I plan to go to Paul Mitchell, the school in Columbia. After graduation, I plan to attend Northwest Missouri State University and a major in psychology and minor in theater. I plan on attending North Central Missouri College and getting my associate's degree in nursing. Thank you, Caden. And now let's have your birthdays. Happy birthday to Evan Houck and Seth Webbington. Happy birthday, guys. We hope you had a great week and enjoy the show. We'll see you next week. Stay classy, Princeton.